Hi. <laughs> Welcome to the first ever Toss the Tiara Show. There you go, you said you wanted a jingle. Yes. <laughs> so, <laughs> so on this show, we are going to be answering questions live yes. from you. Yes. Um, uh, you've got to use the hashtag Toss the Tiara, all one word. Yeah. And we will be answering them on next week's show. Yeah. So for this week, we have a lovely question from Kirsty to start off with. So Kirsty did a, a video message for us, which was amazing. Thank you so much for that, Kirsty. So what was Kirsty's question, Paul? Uh, what is your main tip when looking for your dress? Mm. I'll let you answer that. I would say my main tip would be to look as, as at as much as possible and try on as many as possible as well. Um, just so that you know what suits your style, what suits your shape, you know. Mm -hmm. So, um, yeah, I think that would be. Quite a lot of online shops are doing them, uh, are doing wedding dresses now. So just go online, have a look, look through magazines, look at all those, <laughs> go and have a look through bridal shops and stuff, and just figure out what's, what works for you. There's, there's a lot of um, blogs and stuff out there as well, isn't it, about um, shape guides and stuff like that, and what, yeah. what's flattering for your figure. Yeah. Um, yeah. I haven't personally read them myself. <laughs> yeah, all right. Um, <laughs> so if you're watching this, just uh, just drop, drop a comment below as well. <laughs> um, that'll be absolutely amazing. Yeah. So remember, if you ask a question, um, the best question of the week, We'll win a tiara. A beautiful tiara. Do you like that? Ooh. We'll win. It's so shiny. A tiara. <laughs> but there we go. Beautiful tiara. So, question. Did, did, in fact, we have to do the thing. We have to do the thing. Oh, so, we if we've answered the, the question well enough, yes. which uh, if you think that we've answered the question well enough, then we get to toss the tiara. <laughs> so, when I say toss, I mean. Oh! <laughs> Okay. So there we go. This is quite a new concept for us and it will be less cringy every week, I promise. Yeah. So, next question. Uh, next question <laughs> uh, from Jackie. Oh, thank you, Jackie. And ja Jackie, 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 Jackie is one of the admins. She's been doing a fantastic job. <laughs> and amazing. so, so yeah, Stephanie yeah. as well. So, um, and she asks, um, I want to buy, I want to buy Stephen a gift to give to him on the morning of the wedding. Possibly a watch. Is anyone else getting a gift for their husband, their husband to, be? to be? Good question. It is a good question. And Jess got me a gift. I did. You did on the morning. What did I get you for? Do you, you remember? <laughs> she took a nice she, she took a nice box and, and put some ribbon round it as well. And um she put some aftershave in there. Yes. It's a very, I did. very good aftershave. <laughs> <laughs> she also did something really special. So my um, my granddad passed away around three or four months ago, and it was um, I was very very close to him. He kind of inspired me quite a lot when I was younger, um, and he couldn't be part of us part with us on there on the day. And my mum was quite conscious about having any photos of him around because mm. it was also um him and my grandma's wedding anniversary the same day that we got married which was <laughs> obviously caused cause a bit of awkwardness <laughs> um so what Jess did for me she made me like a little memory memory clip um so I could keep him in my pocket all day um and um so he was always with me throughout the day which was re Aww. really really special <laughs> Um, and did you put something else in there as well? I did, yeah. What else did you put in there? So I put some mints in there, didn't so I? So she put some mints in there because she said we are meant to be together. Yeah, that's cheesy. that's how cheesy she is. So you could do something <laughs> yeah, like that on the, on the morning of the wedding. You know, you could have something that's personal to uh, your other half. Mm -hmm. um, just uh, Oh, you put a nice note in there as well, didn't you? Mm. A lovely, lovely note that I read. Um, and she left me a few clues around the house. I sent him on a treasure trail. Yeah, and um, <laughs> but, and I had some of the guys over the night before the groomsmen, and um, they <laughs> they thought it was going to be something a bit dodgier. So I was out. I'm opening it when they, when I, <laughs> when when you lot have gone. <laughs> uh, but yes, it it, it, it was it was a very nice very nice touch, and I think it really kind of started off the day well. Mm -hmm. um, I actually looked at it the night before the wedding, 
uh, because I had too much to look at uh, and organise on the day of the wedding um, as a quiet list. Yeah. So, uh, oh, by the way, if you're watching this, just say hi as well. Um, it's lovely for you to join us on the first Toss the Tiara show. Toss the Tiara show. Hey! What do you think of that one? Toss the Tiara show. Terrible. We'll work on it. We'll work on it. Um, uh, so thank you, Jackie, for your question. So does, does that can, can, can we toss the tiara? So what's our final answer on that? What do you mean? What's the final? What's the final answer on grooms a good, good for the groom. Is that a good idea? Or yeah, what? go for it. Go yeah. for it. Uh, hi, Katie. Hi, Katie. Um, <laughs> I go. I go for it. I'd um, like from my perspective. Hey, Kirsty. Um, hi, Kirsty. We just answered your question as well. So watch, watch this back as well. Um, hi, uh, hi Amy. Amy. See you. You're all saying hi <laughs> now. There we go. It just takes one to start, and then we're all, we're all there. So um, I would say yes. Get a gift for your husband to be. Watch is a great idea as well. There is um, and having that engraved with something special is really nice good. Idea, isn't it? Um, like I say, having something uh, that's that's going to be memorable for years to come, and having a, a nice handwritten note or something in there as well oh. is a really uh, special thing. Yeah. So, so go for it, go for it on that. Yeah. Yeah. Are we Toss tossing the tiara. tiara. Oh. Woo! <laughs> you whacked me in the face. Sorry. We're, we're working on the Toss the Tiara. <laughs> Just going to show you this again. It's so pretty. It's much bigger than mine as well. It's still in one piece. It is still in one piece. It's much we bigger than mine as well. We will buy a new one, I promise. Uh, yeah. So, next question. Next question. Has anyone got wedding insurance? Ah. Um, I'm thinking about getting it. Uh, this is from Michelle. And she says, has anyone got wedding insurance? We didn't have wedding insurance. No, we didn't, did we? No. Should we have had wedding sh insurance? Um, well, if any of our suppliers decided to go bust or whatever. We were stuck. We'd be a bit buggered. So I think the reason we didn't have wedding insurance is because the majority of the suppliers we knew very well. It yeah. is a beautiful tiara, Kirsty, def def definitely. She keeps putting it on all the time. I, like, I can't stop putting it on. It's so pretty. I just want to play with it all the time. I know. Ooh, feel like a princess. Hi, Sonia. Hi, Sonia. <laughs> um, so, in terms of wedding insurance, I'd... What would you, what would you say? It's a tricky one. I think if you're organising your wedding for like another two years or so, mm -hmm. that might be worthwhile. I think it's how well you know things in the industry. So for yeah. for us, it wasn't too much of an issue because we use a lot of suppliers that we that we knew we trust. The venue uh, the venue uh, decor company, I'd, I've known them for about five or six years anyway, um, and they've been doing the same thing at the same place for years and years and years. <laughs> yeah. Um, the venue I'd worked there before. Hey Donna as well. Hi Donna. Um, so we we knew them. Um, entertainment wise, we'd met them before and everything. Um, I, and yeah. I, I think every supplier we knew in some capacity. Yeah, and uh, not as, as well as that, we had contracts in place with all of them, didn't we? Yes. Um, I, th I so... think you can. How do I put this without being there? Oh, stuff it. You can cover your ass. Um, Apologies. By um, getting contracts in place, um, and we've talked about kind of having some kind of legal contracts in place, and, yeah, and just to cover yourself. That, that that's one level of it. If you want to go for wedding insurance as well, there's no harm. Um, I noticed as soon as they said cover your ass, I got a load of likes. <laughs> might, might, might have to use some more <laughs> choice words later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at this flipping tiara. <laughs> <laughs> um, so <laughs> I think there's no harm in it if you, if you've got the budget for it. Yeah. Um, Do we know how much it is? Because you had a quick look. Well, uh, yeah, I had a quick look, and I think it started at like twenty pounds or something like that. Was it? Hi, cat. Hi, cat. So that's, twenty quid is kind of next to nothing I'm, to protect yourself. Really. I'm not sure. I might have quoted that completely wrong. So we we got we got eleven people okay. watching live right Ooh, now as well. Hi. Um, <laughs> So in case you don't know who we are and what we're about, we are Jess and Paul from Dream Wedding Secrets. And hello, yes, hello. Hello, <laughs> yes. We set up the Dream Wedding Brides group uh, when we were planning our wedding. Uh, so we've got a kind of community to help and support each other, which is why we don't allow any sellers or anything in the group, like 
other wedding group or, thing. Or bad feeling or anyone bad mouthing things. Yeah, if anybody says a If anyone's comment, nasty, you're out. You're gone. Yeah. <laughs> so be Wedding warned. should be nice. <laughs> um, Happy planning. So I've just had a little look round on, on, online and I'd yeah. say your best idea is to go to a comparison site, something like Money Money Supermarket it, yeah. um, or that um, Martin, Martin Lewis. Um, he knows his stuff. Yeah. A maid of honour is allowed in the group. Mm, it it depends. Re really, really, it's mainly mainly for brides. Um, and the 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 reason is like sometimes brides want want to speak confidentially with other brides. Um, About and, the maid of honour. And uh, <laughs> yeah, and and you you think as as you get closer to the wedding, there will be things that you want to discuss. Pot potentially, it, it might not be moaning about the maid of honor, but it might be you might be arranging some kind of surprise for the maid of honor. Yeah. Uh, and you can't do that if you then uh, added them to the group. Um, so so might not be the we we really want to be keeping it to brides because um, then it it means you can all help each other and you can discuss everything completely openly. Yeah. Um, and the only reason I'm allowed in because I was a founder, but I'm not allowed You're in. Not allowed in. in. Well, I'm not. I, I'm only I allowed on these out. videos. I'm <laughs> I created the group and then I kicked myself out. <laughs> so I'm only allowed on these videos and that's it. Yes. Really. You're here for a man's perspective only. For a man's perspective. Because <laughs> I'm obviously a really butch man. What, what group, group is, is this? this? This group. It's the Dream Wedding Brides. It's Dream Wedding group. Brides group. The, 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 the group that we're in at, at the moment. Yeah. So, so we're, we're just saying that kind of we design this for brides. Yes. Uh, I, I'm on so many, <laughs> <laughs> but you always comment on this one, Kat. To be fair, this one's uh, the best you one. are in the Dream Weddings Brides group right now, and uh, <laughs> that's yeah, true. Exactly, exactly. you've yeah. got it, you've yeah. got it. Yeah, maid of honour can, can blab to the grooms, it. Um, that's why we keep it all just kind of nice and private. Yeah, um, which is which is great. So, um, going back to Toss the Tiara show, Toss the Tiara show. Michelle's question about wedding insurance. Yes. Do we need it? Do There's no harm in getting it. Compare your prices, compare the different companies, go to a reputable company. Yeah. Um, looking through here, you've got John Lewis, uh, Debenhams, um, e &L, e &L, e &L, e &L, whoever wedding that. insurance. Yeah. Sometimes you can find these things at wedding fairs as well, so you can go and actually chat to the actual supplier. And... I've seen um, John Lewis quite a bit uh, doing selling yeah, wedding do, insurance yeah. and uh, sure in Debenhams, though, wedding well. gift lists and stuff like that as well. Yeah. And so that's yeah. quite helpful. So yeah, so worth worth, <laughs> worth looking at. Um, it says damages or loss of a wedding attire, wedding cake, and wedding flowers up to fifteen thousand. Legal expenses cover up to ten thousand. So what um, I mean in simple terms. I would say what you need to watch out for is what it actually covers you for. If you are going to get wedding insurance, what are you covered for? Are you just covered if something gets damaged, or are you covered if a company um, goes bust? So, yes. um, did you say Greenwoods has gone bust? Yeah. So Greenwoods has gone bust, and and they've been around for like since eighteen hundreds. Yeah, they are. Eighteen seventies or something was there like that. There was a venue. There was uh, a yeah, venue there's venue. That went I think this yeah. group is just fab. Uh, I've seen so many lovely ideas and good support from other brides. Oh, th oh thank you very much. That's so being. good, Sonia. Uh, that's lovely. that's the exact reason why we did it all. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> which is brilliant. Oh, um, that means the world to us. It really does. So. Very much kind of look at what's included. Um, I'd say the big things you you want to cover for your own illness as well. Say say say. Okay, yeah, I didn't know you could do that. Well, I, th I think I think I think you can. Um, so say you were um, not what? not struck down with flu, but if if there was a serious illness that happened, um, that that some that that meant you had to postpone the wedding and then you lost massive deposits. Mm. Um, you know some of the bigger venues they do take big big deposits yeah um and you don't want to just lose that if something happened so if it gives you peace of mind it's worth doing mm -hmm. but just check what's covered and don't, yeah don't take our word for that no please. um uh, <laughs> we, we we are not allowed to give legal advice no <laughs> <laughs> We're not it's one thing we can't do no, no. um if you are a lawyer just 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 like this post now <laughs> See, no one's liking, no one's lawyers in here. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> right, so that was Michelle's Does that mean question. we get to toss a tiara? Yes. And... Oh! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> you dropped it. Still surviving. It's here. It's still Woo! surviving. Super pretty. <laughs> so who is going to win this? I don't know. 
So we've got one more question. One more question. Who's this one from? So Rianne. Um, and Rianne says, should I stay in the hotel the night before um, or oh, with my other half? Interesting question. And she said her other half wanted her to stay. Oh. Um, which is which is really sweet on her other half's perspective. Yeah. At the same time, though, it's really fun to have a night in the hotel the night before with your maid of honour and your bridesmaids and uh, painting your nails and stuff like that. Yeah, and me and the groomsmen, nice. we did all of that as well. <laughs> Do you paint your fizzles now? Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. Knew it. <laughs> yeah, they, they, they looked wonderful. Um, we did a few yeah. makeup trials and stuff as well and played a bit of spin the bottle and yeah. <laughs> Oh. Well, how do you know? You weren't there. <laughs> to be fair, as grooms, as the groom and the groomsmen, we we spent most of the night just uh, playing with the video cameras that we hired for the next day, um, and going. So all I've got is a load of clips of going like that with a zoom <laughs> function and going. Is this on? <laughs> um, and that was that was pretty much. And and then we had pizza and stuff. As well. You have pizza as well. Yeah, so I quite liked it, the fact that this went to a hotel the night before, and I think it made it more special the next morning. I think it did, yeah, because I really felt like I really missed you the next day. Well, and why I, would you I not? I'm, wait, I'm amazing. I couldn't wait to see you, which yeah. is crazy, because we've been together. Look at all these ha-ha-has <laughs> now, right? Ha-ha-ha. <laughs> 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 yeah, we must be. So, so, yeah, it's completely up to you. I mean, obviously, if you stay in the hotel, you mm. don't have to hire a car. Yeah. Really? So it might co it might cost you 120 quid for the room for the night, or on, or 200 quid or whatever. But it's yeah. probably going to cost you 350 quid for a car. So you might as well, really. Yeah. So it's definitely um, something uh, worth thinking about. In and then it was it was quite good the day on the day as well because we can just get rid of you in the room and we can just waltz over and we're ready. And someone from the venue came and collected me when it was like time for the ceremony and stuff. Yeah, and and which was quite nice. Um, really. We were good at not meeting each other by accident as well. She stayed out of the way. <laughs> um, yeah, because I came down for breakfast, didn't I? And yeah. I was like... My well, maid I was of honor, My maid of honour friend put a bag over my head to bring me down to breakfast just so you could <laughs> see me. I said to her, I'm not Sounds doing that. Sounds very much that. like what I'm she's doing. I'm not doing yeah. that. <laughs> she's part of this group as well because she's getting married next year. <laughs> she is? Yeah, yeah. So. so she's busy planning her wedding as well. Yeah. yeah. Um, we can feel free to give that help with that as well. So I hope that answers your question, Rianne. So, so just to um, summarise that. To summarise that. We did it. We did it. You it don't have great. to do it. We you. we felt it was great. <laughs> um, and if you're not bothered about having a wedding car, I mean, you can still have a wedding car as well and have that outside if you want to. You really want it, But yeah. to, to be honest, like for for us, we were we we looked into getting like a 1950s car, like, but yeah, we couldn't gonna, find one, could we? <laughs> not in the area, no. And it was going to be like 450 quid. Yeah, it was um, So instead, you had a nice night to yourself. Um, the the groomsmen slash ushers, uh, if you're more <laughs> traditional, um, they they didn't stay over the night. But this, to be fair, was like, oh, you probably stayed till about ten o'clock, half past twelve. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, half past twelve they went home yeah. um, after a few drinks and stuff, and then we got up at like uh, half past six uh, to get get everything ready for the next day. So it is such a long day as well. Just yeah. be prepared. Yeah. So let's toss the tiara for that one then. So well, well, the, just just comment if you think we should toss the tiara for that. Do do you think? Have we answered that? Have we answered that question? <laughs> have we? Well, I don't know. Suspense. I think it's all part yeah. of the excitement and 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 that the night. Nice. Star system. Like it. Yeah. Like yeah. It. Uh, I, I think I think <laughs> very much kind of. It, you you can choose your wedding to be as short or as long as you want, but it's kind of like building that experience from day one. Like yeah. you guys being part of this group, guys and girls, well, girl, girls, yeah, it's all, it's all, all girls, <laughs> love, lovely ladies, being part <laughs> being part of this group, it's building that excitement and everything and making that experience something to remember from the start to the finish, as opposed to it just being on the day. You know, and the more you can build that, the the better, and the more it feels like value for money and an experience that you remember for years to come. Yeah? Sound good? Very good, yeah. Sound good. <laughs> what are we going to do? Toss it to your heart. Well, one final time. Ah. Woo! <laughs> so, so we have tossed a tiara for all the times that we're going to do today, but, but there's one thing left to do. Now, each week, the best question will get a win, a tiara. We'll win the tiara. We'll win 
the tiara. <laughs> and we promise, even yeah. though we've tossed it quite a few times, it is not damaged. No. Look, it's in good condition. You can send a new one though. <laughs> well, you, we can, yeah, we'll keep this one, I think. So, <laughs> this can be the one uh, you happen. two are so happy all the time. We well, have to be. <laughs> We, you know we and are? you know what? We don't even take drugs. <laughs> <laughs> well, I take prescribed <laughs> ones. <laughs> You'll get a reputation, woman. I have MS, so I take prescribed drugs, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, um, they definitely don't make me happy. Though. Sometimes I take paracetamol <laughs> if I'm going crazy. Oh, yeah. we're just high on caffeine, to be honest. Yeah. We just drink a lot of tea. <laughs> See that? See that? Look, tea. There's that one as well, yeah. Yeah, look, look. So much tea. That's just today. That's just this hour. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It really is. If you want to be happy in life, drink tea. <laughs> and lo lots of it until you go, rah! Right, anyway. Sorry. Who, who is winning this lovely tiara? Today? Who's going to win this tiara? The person who's going to win this tiara is the person, or is the person... That was my drum roll. It was really bad. ...that has done the first <laughs> ever video for Tossa Tiara. Sure, it's not wine. <laughs> I wish it, it could, was wine. <laughs> it could, yeah, it could, yeah she, she does. Uh, s some of that wine tastes a bit dodgy that you buy. <laughs> it does. Um, yeah, the person who's yeah. going to win the tiara yeah. is, and I need to get the name right, otherwise, it, is <laughs> Kirsty. Woo! Well, so congratulations, Kirsty, because she, she was you won. she was the only one to send in an actual video. Yes. So get it for the video. So just. <laughs> If, if you want to ask a question for next week's Toss the Tiara show, which will be on Monday, yep. um, we won't give an exact time yet, um, but it's going to be Monday evening. It'll be around this time. It'll be around this time, uh, and it should be every week. Um, <laughs> and we're, we're looking at putting it onto my Facebook page, so it'd be good yep. to get your feedback on that as well, um, if, if you think um, that would be... A good thing better to do, worse. better or worse. Is it better to have it in the Dream Wedding Bride group or on Poor Lace Music's Facebook page? And, and, and the, Let us know. the reason we're thinking about doing it on there is because then um, we can get a lot more people involved as well. Because obviously, if you're not in the group, then you're not going to see this. Yeah, uh, yeah well done, Kirsty. Well done, Kirsty. Um, is she still here? Is she gone? I, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not oh. sure. I, I, hopefully, she'll be. I'll she'll have be to back. message her in a minute. Yeah, we'll, we'll <laughs> message her. Um, so. Basically, Kirsty has won the tiara. We're, we're going to get that sent out to her. Yep. If you want to get your question answered on Toss the Tiara, what do you need to do, Jess? Well, you've got one or two things you can do. You've got two you? things you can do. You can either send us a video of your question, which gets your extra brownie points. Yes, yeah, see, Kirsty's here. Woo! It will go in my address too. Good. <laughs> it, it won't really wobble in my address as well, Kirsty. <laughs> um, it really brought out my eyes as well. Yeah. So you can send a video yeah, like <laughs> with Kirsty your did. question with the hashtag Toss the Tiara. Yeah. Or you can write out a comment. Yeah, as you're all doing lots of comments as well. And on the end of it, you put hashtag Toss the Tiara. Yeah, hashtag Toss the Tiara, toss one word. Tiara. And we will search a hashtag on on the Monday and yeah. look at all the questions. We we try not to look too far beforehand, so we kind of answer them a little bit more ad lib and a bit more naturally. Yes, not. This is not rehearsed, by the way. It's never rehearsed, but you could probably tell. It, yeah, <laughs> yeah, you probably can. Yeah. So well done to Kirsty. Yeah, well done to Kirsty. Beautiful tiara. So you've just kind of got to put pins on the on the on the hair grips. On yeah, the hair grips. Yeah. Secure it in, but yeah, so pretty. I'll see if I've got any of mine spare. Yeah. Like, just borrow some of yours. Like. Yeah, yeah. It it holds me quiffing. It does. I've got no quiffing today. It's no good. So that, anyway, <laughs> yeah, you do wonder. See, look, people are leaving now. I've talked about me quick. Well, it's upsetting now. Gonna, I'm, so, I'm sorry. Oh no, someone's come back. You someone's come back. Dress. That's why. Yeah. yeah. Well, I'm scared them off. Well, right, that, <laughs> hey, I, I tell you something. People will pay a lot of money to see me in a dress. No, you wouldn't. I'm not okay, gonna. Yeah, anyway. broken. So congratulations to <laughs> Kirsty, and um, thank you to everyone who's commented so far. Yes. Uh, remember, use the hashtag Toss the Tiara to ask your question for next week to be in with the chance of winning your Toss the Tiara. tiara. <laughs> um, and might come up with a jingle by next week. What do you yeah. reckon? Yeah, we'll come up with a jingle. Yeah. I think. So, 
in a couple of weeks' time, hopefully we'll be doing this from Nashville. Live from Nashville. Live from Nashville in Tennessee. Oh yeah. Um, and it's gonna be y'all, y'all great. Well, how y'all doing, y'all? How y'all doing? <laughs> yeah. Toss it to Yara. Toss it to Yara. Toss it to Yara. Yeah. What do you reckon, that one? We'll keep working on it. We'll keep working on we'll it. Keep working on it. There we go. Okay. That is Toss the Tiara. Thank so, you. Get your questions in for next week. And hashtag Toss the Tiara. Yeah. See you again. Remember, soon. you just won. Dream, Dream away. away. Cheers. Bye. Bye.